This is the W1001 Foamworks Cutting Kit. It includes a 32 inch channel rail, a rabbit cutter, a freestyle cutter, a straight bevel cutter, and the Foam Board Magic Book, 71 pages of information on how to get the most out of this kit. This is the Foamworks Straight Bevel Cutter. We're going to use the channel rail to guide us through the cut. I would put a pencil mark here and here according to where I want to cut it and then set the rail right there and then now this does not hook on here it just uses it at a straight edge. Put it right up here and your piece is sized the way you want it. Now if I wanted to cut a 45 degree edge instead of a straight edge, I would release this little knurled knob right here and turn this piece around to the 45 degree format using the same system I just described. I would come in here and it will give you a perfect 45. To find the blade storage on the straight bevel cutter, remove this little cap and there are your blades at the back. When using the straight bevel cutter and some of the other Foamworks tools, always put a piece of foam core under your work. That protects your work, it protects the blade on the Foamworks cutter, and it protects the table and everything else. Just make that a habit. This is the Foamworks Freestyle Cutter. To use, you release this knurled knob, pull back this piece here which protects the blade, and then expose the blade, which that does, and tighten that back down. In using the freestyle cutter, place it flat on here, don't tilt it up or down or anything, and perhaps you've drawn some lines on here that you want to follow. You can do that, or you can just go like this, and just go anywhere you want to go. Let your artistic soul guide you. When you finish, don't forget to put this blade back in this little housing so you don't cut yourself. And this is what we have. To find the blade storage on the freestyle cutter, turn it over and there's a little door here that hides the blades. You can slide it out and there is the blade. This is the Foamworks Rabbit Cutter. It prepares the edges of your foam so that you can join it and have a perfect 90 degree angle. You can use it on the right hand side or the left hand side depending on whether you're right handed or left handed. You don't put a piece of uh, foam core down to work on top of this time. You hold it up in the air. Now this is the idea. You see it cut through here like this and left just a little bit. You take your other piece of board and put it on here and you've got your perfect 90 degree joint. To find the blade storage on the rabbit cutter, remove the little cap and there is your blade. The Foamworks channel rail is made of aluminum. It has a 32 inch scale on it. The other side has a channel where some of the Foamworks tools fit and you can guide them along. On the other side there are two rubber strips embedded so that when you put it on your work surface it doesn't slide around. Also with this kit you get the Foam Board Magic Book. It has hundreds of illustrations in here of what you can do with this kit. This is 71 pages of really neat ideas.